Hi, Albert here with Mainland Cycle Center. Today I want to show you the 2017 Kawasaki Vulcan 1700 Voyager. And this is ABS. These are all ABS. We used to offer these with or without ABS, but now they are only made in the ABS, the anti-lock brake system. Of course, the Voyager, really a fine touring bike. These things are uh, really great. For the money, they're hard to beat. This is probably... Uh, uh, not quite half the price of a gold wing, but probably could be close depending on what model and certainly uh, probably half the price almost of a Harley uh, Full dress bike and that uh, really is a nice riding bike definitely hard to beat for the money 1700 cc v twin uh, Liquid cooled fuel injected these have hydraulic valve lash adjusters So there's no valve clearance adjustments to do it has driver and passenger floorboards and you've got these little rubber mounts on them that uh, Damp and vibration on those. Uh, lower leg fairings that you can open and close there. Uh, the highway bar. You've got uh, driving lights as well as a nice big high and low beam headlight there. Uh, like I said, this has dual disc brakes, four piston calipers, and ABS. This also has the Kawasaki K Act, which is an active braking system or a linked braking system, but it's a little different from some of the other manufacturers' linked braking system in that uh, if you apply either one of the brakes, it will send braking force to uh, both the front and the rear, and then that, uh, once you get down to a lower speed, the brakes are completely separate again. Uh, one of the uh, complaints that initially had this bike's been out basically since uh, I believe 09 2010 09 and uh, One of the complaints they had on the early models was uh, heat and so Kawasaki has some, done some things on these bikes to reduce the amount of heat that the passengers getting the driver the riders uh, are getting and so uh, basically they closed in the a shroud behind the radiator fan I don't know if you can kind of see right there where that little piece of rubber fits tight against so anyway they're trying to force that air down down below the engine and then also they have a little port right here and on the other side we'll take a look there's a fan in a little deal and so when the radiator fan comes on that fan on the side comes on and uh, it'll draw heat draw heat from that other side and it comes out here down low so away from uh, the riders so Kawasaki has really done some things to improve uh, the heat management on this bike. You've got these nice large saddlebags with the uh, top opening bag there. And of course they're lockable there. Nice big tour pack with uh, wrap around backrest. And again that is lockable also. Side opening there. Really nice. A little better than when they open the other way because you've got a passenger on. It's a little uh, not quite as uh, intrusive to them trying to open the bag with a passenger sitting on the bike uh, electronic cruise control standard on these bikes so there's your uh, your cruise control buttons right down there as well as uh, to, to, to change what's being displayed on the on the dash LED rear tail light and then it has two LED lights here across the back of that trunk air shocks on the back of these uh, Great instrumentation. You've got a fuel gauge, speedometer, tachometer, temperature gauge, and then here you've got gear position indicator. Here's gear position indicator, and then you've got uh, mileage, uh, trip meters, as well as some fuel economy modes there and some warning lights. And then you've got your audio system down here. So this says AM, FM, weather band, auxiliary input on it. You can add satellite radio to it, and you can add a uh, auxiliary input cable to these. You've got your audio controls here on the left hand handlebar. These do have self canceling turn signals. But uh, really like I said these bikes really ride great and they're really hard to beat for the money. Uh, I'm a big fan of full dress touring bikes and uh, I had a full dress touring bike when I was 18 years old and uh, loved them and have had numerous ones over the years so uh, anyway I love the Voyager a lot for the money like I said it is hard hard to beat all right well that's a look at the 2017 Kawasaki Voyager 1700 uh, in this black and two-tone gray I don't think we talked about the color it has a nice little green pinstripe down it great looking bike 
All right, we are Mainland Cycle Center. We're located in Lamarck, Texas. We're about 30 minutes south of downtown Houston, just off of I-45. You can find us online at mainlandcyclecenter.com or by phone at 409-948-4969. And we would just love it if you'd give us a call, shoot us an email, or even better, come by and see us in person here at Mainland Cycle Center, where we would love to help any way that we can. Hey, thanks for watching.